another video. It has been a while. Well, so today we have a legacy collection. I've been waiting for this for years. So I've been super excited to get a berry, and we finally have one. This was a nice raptor skin here. But first, before we get that, I do want to just go ahead and say these new Godzilla X Con figures are amazing. As this is what started my YouTube channel. But I am obsessed with the Scar King one. I love the thing, the design on it, and I also have Shimu or whatever. I'm not Shimu. Um, Suko and Doug. Then I got Khan with his weird beast club. But well, this isn't the video. I just had to point this out that these are amazing and. If you want any of them, get Scar King. He is probably the best figure that I've ever owned from this franchise. Without that, let's take a look at the box. I'm not that much of a fan of the box packaging, but I like the way that they show it on the back. And it's Charlie? Hmm, why didn't they do Delta? Well, I'm gonna get into this. And, like, I ended up losing the video to some of my unboxings that I did. For Christmas, but most of the stuff I didn't finish opening, so we'll get that done when we get back home, as I am not home right now. If you guys would like to get this, this is a Target, I think only Target. It's not online yet, so you have to go in store. Oh my god. Sometimes I wonder why the heck they have to package it like that. Here's some scissors. Do I have any scissors? Yes, I do. Yes, you suggest that you get those Godzilla X Con figures, the new Empire. They're amazing. I got them at Target as well, but I got them yesterday. I didn't realize my YouTube channel was up because I ended up being suspended for reviewing something. And I'm back, but anyways, I didn't have too much stuff to post about over the time. But why do they have blue? normal like usually they don't put glue on these like they really don't want somebody getting into this like why can't they just do tape i know that i'm trying to open this right in front of my camera like look this is literally just glue I usually am a good complainer on the way to package this. This is probably one of the worst. There we go. Okay. That took me a little bit, but it did it. So, let's take a look. Um, let me snip these little guys out. Let's just get Charlie out, take a look at Charlie first. So, here's Charlie. It looks way lighter green on the camera. Yeah, the camera ain't doing the justice on how light this is. And I, I that is a nice, that gives me like the first Jurassic Park vibes for a sculpt. I don't know why, but it has a good size. Mm, the, the arms are really stiff, but maybe that's just mine. Um, that scan code is also stuck. Here's the code. I don't scan mine anymore. Well, I haven't been getting too much of these lately. But, it's an okay raptor. I've kind of gotten tired of the Jurassic franchise right now, but hoping that this new Jurassic 7 coming July 2nd will bring some new good toys. Well, that's Charlie. Um... Go ahead. We have Mattel actually bringing us a gun. It's a sniper. That's that's maybe they, if they, I know it's a lot to ask, but maybe they could make the 
weapons that they give these people more detailed. And I will be picking up the what is it, the Dieter Stark and Dieter Stark, whatever, and Compies, so the Velociraptor set with I think a Compie in it. I did see it today, but I just didn't want to spend the money right now. Come on. You know, you're the star of the set, and you're the hardest to get out of the set. Why do they wrap them up inside of this stuff? It's like stuck in him. What the heck? Okay. Okay. After what? 2015 almost. Nine years? And they finally have a figure for him. Nine years that they could have made this, and it takes them nine years. Almost ten years since 2015. Jurassic World is almost 10 years. That's insane. Jurassic Park was 30 last year. 31 this year. But the sculpt, it's okay. it's um, it's good for a legacy collection. Because legacy collections suck at getting the sculpt right. I don't think I've ever seen a legacy collection get a sculpt right. And this is honestly pretty good in my opinion. Well, Robert Muldoon. Oh, not Robert Muldoon. Oh, what is it? What is that guy's name from The Lost World? The Hunter, what is his name? I always forget it. Ronald Temp. Ronald, it's Ronald or something. But he's probably the best sculpt that they've gotten, but this one is okay looking. Let's see if the camera doesn't want to focus. Yeah, there we go. It's an okay sculpt, but... Mm. But the clothing design, it's good. It's nice. There's Barry. After nine years, we finally got him. And he has an ATV. A four-wheeler. It looks good. The wheels are... Yeah, really. But it's stable when you try to, like... Yeah, it's good. Um, It's really big, though, for, like, a person. Maybe they could sized it down a bit like look at this compared to the figure that is massive comparing it to the raptor it's even it's bigger than the raptor but the set was only 25 bucks and i mean they could have maybe done like 19 99 20 bucks well no wait the set was 25 bucks yes i mean maybe they could have i don't know maybe this was worth a little more for like 20 or 15 dollars like 14.99 but you know i had to get it like this is something that has been one of, i've been waiting for so i was really not wanting to spend the money right now but hey i mean it's barry he's an amazing character well This is my first review in probably about two, almost two months going on. Last one was in, what, November, December? It was the Allosaurus, which I had to pick that up. I love the Allosaurus figures, but, well, here's this. Well, let me think of something. Stay Jurassic. And being chilling.